what you see behind me is fixing one of the biggest problems. But first, let me tell you what the problem is. Flooding. Flooding happens when water overflows into an entire city. This can ruin homes, streets, and lives. And according to data, flooding is only gonna be a bigger and bigger problem. Take Bangkok, for example. Bangkok was a small city near a river, but over the years, the city grew with more concrete buildings and streets. It went from a land that could absorb water to a land that could not. So when it rains in Bangkok, it can more often than not flood, and that can be deadly. Authorities struggle to evacuate people. The severe flooding here in the Northeast as more rain continues to fall today. It's a real problem in this city, your city, and most cities around the world. They are sinking while the water levels are rising. And that's where this woman comes in. Hi, my name is Coach Korn Barakom. I'm from Thailand and I design parks. She built a park that is designed from the grounds up to protect from flooding. See, unlike the flat streets of Bangkok, this park is tilted up. So when it rains, the water doesn't stay in one place. It falls down to the bottom and is collected here in a water pond. Then she built a water tank underneath the park that collects all the rain. So the water that would normally flood is now stored inside this park. And in the dry season, the tank is used to water the plants. Up to one million gallons of water can be saved this way. It's a win, win, win. From this park, I want people to learn how to live with nature and that nature keep changing. So I want people to be able to adapt to the new challenge of climate change. In reality though, this park is only 0.003% of Bangkok area. So realistically, it will not fix the flooding problem, but it's a good start. It's a good start for smarter city development. It's a good start for making a city more green. It's a good start for water conservation. My next goal is to create more parks. And if there is one thing we can learn from this park and this woman is that no water should ever be wasted. Not even one drop of it.